Wow, I am speechless. I have not seen us play that great since, geez, maybe even last year. So pretty much I'm just gonna be taking you guys over the game that happened today against the Dockers and the Saints. Obviously, we got over the line by six points. Jeez, my heart is still beating really fast and the game ended about half an hour ago. Oh, I am so happy, so unexpected. Such a good comeback, just so many things to go over. Sorry, Cardi, he's just messaged me. He says, um, every time you sent another message, I kept on getting more angry because I just kept on giving him shit about the game. <laughs> Sorry, Cardi, if you're watching this, but yeah. Anyway, let's start it with uh, Michael Walters just absolutely, yeah, I don't know what he was thinking. He just kicked it the wrong way, first clearance, and the Saints got the first goal on the board with about 20 seconds into the game. So yeah, horrible start from the Dockers. Obviously, we did build from that. I think quarter time was 36 points down. Just absolutely horrible. Second quarter, we did come back, and yeah, we did, uh, we did all right. I think we were still down by about seven points at half time. Third quarter was the big quarter, very big quarter for us. Um, I, I think the Saints were scoreless in the third quarter and we kicked about, geez, we kicked heaps of goals that quarter to bring it back to, I think we were in front at three quarter time. Yeah, I think we were in front by about seven points. And then obviously last quarter was just way too hectic. Last five minutes, probably one of the games of the year. All right, so we're starting it off first quarter. Uh, Saints got first goal in 20 seconds. Michael Walters kicked it the wrong way to start off. That was a horrible start. Uh, we kicked, I think they kicked it, they kicked the first two goals and then we got one back and then they just kept on scoring goal after goal. Yeah, at the end of quarter time it was 44 to 8. So that is a massive quarter for the Saints there. And then we scored five goals to one in the second quarter so there we go there's the first bit of the comeback then we scored three goals to none in the uh, third quarter so there's another bit of the comeback and then obviously last quarter we finished it off scored three goals to three anyway yeah three goals each in the last quarter the Saints came back I think last 30 seconds there was a throw in just outside of the Saints 50 and I was geez, I was sweating I was sweating so hard just so nervous. I thought we were going to choke it like we do normally. Uh, yeah, at quarter time I was going to turn it off. I was just pretty much on my phone during the whole second quarter because I, would n I was not expecting to come back at all. So yeah, I was just on my phone the whole second quarter, not expecting anything. And then I saw at half time that we're actually doing all right and we're coming back. Uh, yeah, I was texting Cardi a fair bit through throughout the game and he, yeah. He didn't respond to any of my messages probably either because he was angry because we were coming back or maybe he was just focusing on the game. <laughs> now yeah, great performance by our second quarter. I don't really remember what exactly happened in the second quarter. I'm pretty sure we just scored uh, a fair bit of goals to make it come back to a slim margin at half time. Third quarter is where everything happened. They scored absolutely nothing. Yeah, if they scored, I reckon we would have lost momentum and then they would have came back and won. But yeah, it was pretty much just all momentum, pressure. Yeah, yeah, the Saints did not perform too well. I don't know if the Saints didn't perform too well or we just came back and performed really well. So I think it was a bit of both. The Saints did drop off after the first quarter, seems though they were up by 40 points. That's why I get angry at Freo sometimes, because say if we're only up by about 10 points at a break, then they just drop off because they think it's just so easy. They just drop off because they're in front. And I'm like, you can't just do that because they're just going to come back stronger than ever. Seems though they're down. Then they'll be angry, so then they'll come back fast. Look, horrible performance by the Saints in that second half. Uh, very good performance by us. Fourth quarter, I'm pretty sure it was in the last... Uh, two minutes, last two minutes, Mike Walters gave away a 50 um, in the centre square. So then they went forward and they scored a goal to make it a draw. And that's when my heart really sank. And I was expecting for us to choke really hard. And I was expecting the Saints to win. Oh, my heart, dude. I feel so sick. I still feel sick. We finished... Jeez, the game finished like almost, I reckon, almost about 40 minutes ago and my stomach is so sore, it's just hurting so much, I feel sick because of the game. Anyway, I'll try my best to compose, but don't know if that'll happen. 
Anyway, that's going to be it for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed. Uh, yeah, a bit of a quick, bit of a quick video. Just wanted to kind of go over the game a bit with you guys because I reckon it is worth. Uh, to do the content on this match because it was just an absolutely insane comeback and also it was a very interesting game. Seems like the Saints were up by about 36 points at quarter time. I think that that's one of our best games probably over the past year I would say. Uh, once again uh, the Saints, very good team, one of the best teams in the league this year so far and the Freo Dockers, look we are all right. Uh, I wouldn't say we're too good. We have put up a good fight against all the teams, but this game, especially against the Saints, we just showed everything into the second quarter, third quarter, and fourth quarter, and we just bring it home. So yeah, very proud of the boys for bringing it home, obviously against a very good side, which is the Saints. Uh, so yeah, make sure you guys like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next one.